In Release 2014A, you can use the pop-up command history for recalling and finding recently used commands in the command window. To view the command history, press the up arrow key in the command window. You can press Enter to rerun the most recent command. You can continue to press the up arrow followed by Enter to rerun an earlier command or you can rerun a command by double-clicking on it. You can also modify a recalled command before running it. Now let's say that you wanted to recall a command that you used to plot some data. By pressing the up arrow, you can see a log of previous commands that you ran in MATLAB that started with plot. Note that the commands that generated errors are marked, as well as the number of times a command was repeatedly run. You can optionally show the execution time for commands that took over 0.1 seconds. You can select multiple entries using the shift up or down arrow, or by holding down the shift key and selecting the commands you wish to run. Brackets on the left side indicate the commands were run in a group. You can select the bracket to rerun the entire group. You can adjust the command history to allow for both case sensitive and partial matches. You can either select those options or choose them through the match toolbar. For instance, if you want to find the commands where you save the output of your FFT to a variable. You could filter to just see the commands that match your search. You can also detach or dock and undock the command history window. You can access the command window preferences, such as the number of commands you wish to save, in the environment section under preferences. This concludes the video introducing the pop-up command history. You can try this feature now or look in the documentation to find additional information.